On Monday, Governor Greg Gianforte got an up-close look at the facilities and future plans of the Helena Indian Alliance. It's great that the governor has seen us as an organization in the community that is uh, important to what we do uh, and values us enough to come and visit us. Gianforte had a discussion with Alliance leaders, then took a tour of their building, including the Leo Pocha Clinic. The Helena Indian Alliance provides primary care, mental health, behavioral health and substance abuse treatment, plus other resources. The governor says he was particularly impressed by their youth programs. They're getting upstream and helping with after school programs so that hopefully they don't end up in needing some of their other services. In 2021, the Alliance served 4,500 patients. Executive Director Todd Wilson says the clinic is outgrowing their current space. They've made plans for an addition to the building. They're waiting for federal approval before they can move forward. The Indian Alliance is already working with the governor's office. They're a main treatment partner for the ANGEL Initiative, a state program in partnership with the Lewis and Clark County Sheriff's Office. People can turn in small amounts of drugs and get connected with treatment providers without criminal liability. It's really gonna take an all hands on deck approach to help people overcome addiction and become productive members of society. We really value that partnership and working together uh, because it really does take all of us. After a recent string of opioid and fentanyl-related overdoses in the Helena area, the Leo Pocha Clinic held a series of trainings on how to use the medication Narcan to help reverse an overdose. Leaders say the interest in those trainings was very strong, and they hope to hold similar ones later on this year. In Helena, Jonathan Amberian, MTN News.